फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट परमिसिबिलिटी ऑफ पब्लिकेशन ऑफ फोटोग्राफ्स ऑफ फंक्शनरीज ऑफ द स्टेट एंड पॉलिटिकल लीडर्स एलोंग विद वेरियस गवर्नमेंट एडवर्टीजमेंट्स कॉमन कोज एंड सेंटर फॉर पब्लिक इंटरेस्ट लिटिगेशन टू रजिस्टर्ड बॉडीज हैव अप्रोच द सुप्रीम कोर्ट अंडर आर्टिकल थर्टी टू ऑफ द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन सीकिंग एन अप्रोप्रिएट रिट टू रेस्ट्रेन द यूनियन ऑफ इंडिया एंड ऑल स्टेट गवर्नमेंट्स फ्रॉम यूजिंग पब्लिक फंड्स ऑन गवर्नमेंट एडवर्टीजमेंट्स विच आर प्राइमरली इंटेंडेड टू प्रोजेक्ट इंडिविजुअल फंक्शनरीज ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट और अ पोलिटिकल पार्टी आर्टिकल्स थर्टी एट एंड थर्टी नाइन ऑफ द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन एंड ज्वाइन अपॉन द स्टेट अ ड्यूटी टू कंसिस्टेंटली एंडेवर टू अचीव सोशल एंड इकोनॉमिक जस्टिस टू द टीमिंग मिलियंस ऑफ द कंट्री हु इवन टूडे लिव बिहाइंड एन आर्टिफिशियली ड्रोन पॉवर्टी लाइन वट कैन बी द श्योर वे इन द मार्च फॉरवर्ड देन बाय एंश्योरिंग अवॉइडेंस ऑफ अनप्रोडक्टिव एक्सपेंडिचर ऑफ पब्लिक फंड्स This is how we view the present matter and feel the necessity of exercise of our jurisdiction under Article 142 of the Constitution to proceed further. Governments at the center as well as in the states often bring out advertisements on completion of a number of days, months and years of governance. In such advertisements not only the achievements are highlighted even the different tasks which are in contemplation are enumerated though the achievements of a government should not be a matter of publicity and really ought to be a matter of perception to be felt by the citizens on the results achieved such advertisements do have the effect of keeping the citizens informed of the government functioning and therefore would be permissible there can be no matter of doubt that one government advertisement or the or the other coinciding with some event or occasion is published practically every day publication of the photograph of an individual be a state or party functionary not only has the tendency of associating that particular individual with either the achievements so to be highlighted or being the architect of the benefits in respect of which information is so to be percolated alternatively programs targets for the future as advertised carry the impression of being associated with the particular individuals photographs therefore have the potential of developing the personality cult and the image of one or a few individuals which is a direct antithesis of democratic functioning however there should be an exception only in the case of the president prime minister and chief justice of the country who may themselves decide the question advertisements issued to commemorate the anniversaries of acknowledged personalities like the father of the nation would of course carry the photograph of the departed leader Writ of mandamus cannot be claimed as of a right. On 20th April 2005, the first respondent filed a writ petition. The complaint in the writ petition was that the City Industrial Development Corporation (CIDCO) had been illegally and unauthorizedly using the land without acquiring the same or without paying any compensation thereof. The reliance in this regard was placed upon internal correspondence between sidco and government of maharashtra and the collector he is stated to have sent a representation dated 16th august 2004 to tehsildar requiring the tehsildar to record his name as an heir having failed to receive any response from the concerned authorities he filed the writ petitioner in the high court of bombay the saman boman of the case set up by the first respondent in the writ petition was that 
the appellant herein used the said land without acquiring the same and depriving the trust of its ownership and possession of land. The appellants as well as state of Maharashtra through its secretary to the Ministry of Revenue and the collector Raigad had been implemented as party respondents in the said writ petition. The first respondent writ petitioner claimed to be one of the trustees of Sir Khan Bahadur Hormazji Bhivandiwala Trust and the writ petition itself had been filed in his capacity as trustee. Stop.